We're on the edge of a major breakthrough. Robots with general intelligence are nearly here. Imagine machines that can learn, adapt, and handle a wide range of tasks, bringing us closer to AGI, Artificial General Intelligence. Physical Intelligence, a San Francisco startup, is leading the charge, drawing attention from major figures like Jeff Bezos and companies like OpenAI. With $400 million in funding and a valuation of $2 billion, this startup is pushing the boundaries of what robots can do. Unlike traditional single-task robots, which are are limited to tasks like vacuuming or sorting objects in controlled settings, physical intelligence is working on a revolutionary generalist robot brain. Their new AI model, called Pi Zero, is designed to make robots adaptable and versatile. The goal is to create robots capable of folding laundry, packing eggs, and clearing tables with a fitness that previously been impossible. Most robots today are specialized, performing one job well but struggling to adapt to different tasks or environments. Physical intelligence aims to change this by focusing on software rather than new hardware. Pi Zero serves as a sort of robot brain, empowering almost any robot to handle multiple tasks. Unlike basic robots that follow simple commands, Pi Zero integrates vision, language, and motor skills into a single system. This enables it to see, understand, and act based on its surrounding. Pi Zero can respond to commands like clean up the table, assessing its environment, planning the task, and adjusting as needed. Trained on 10,000 hours of data from various robot systems, it's skilled in not only movement but also fine-tuning its actions based on sensory input, almost like a human. With the ability to perform up to 50 motor commands per second, Pi Zero's movements are precise and fluid, essential for handling delicate items. Physical intelligence has also developed a technique called flow matching, which gives the robot's movement a natural, human-like smoothness as it learns and adapts. What sets Pi Zero apart is its incredible control, which allows it to handle complex tasks like folding clothes, packing grocery, and grinding coffee beans, each requiring a precise balance of strength, accuracy, and flexibility. Achieving this capability took the combined expertise of industry pioneers such as Carol Hausman, a former robotics expert at Google, and Sergey Levine, a Stanford robotics researcher. Their vision was to create robots that could quickly learn new tasks without extensive reprogramming, and they collected 10,000 hours of training data from sources like OKDroid and Bridge datasets to give Pi Zero a solid foundation for tasks ranging from laundry to packing eggs. Pi Zero is designed to work seamlessly across different types of robots, from single arm to dual arm and mobile robots that can move while performing tasks. The ultimate goal for physical intelligence is to make robots as adaptable as large language models like ChatGPT built in the physical world. Imagine coming home to a robot assistant that has vacuumed, folded a laundry, and even started preparing a meal that's the future they envision and are actively building. Pi Zero's adaptability comes from extensive pre-training. Just as ChatGPT and other language models are pre-trained on vast amounts of text data, Pi Zero is pre-trained on diverse robotic actions. Instead of words, it's trained on tasks like folding laundry and stacking eggs without breaking them. After this broad pre-training, Pi Zero can tackle a variety of tasks right out of the box, no additional programming required for basic jobs. For more complex, multi-step tasks, it can be fine-tuned in the same way a language model would be. Physical intelligence had to go beyond existing robotic data, as no vast database of robot actions exists like there is for text. They created their own data set, combining visual and language models that allowed AI to interpret both images and text, and applying AI techniques like diffusion modeling to enable more generalized learning. This innovative approach lets Pi Zero learn faster from limited data and paves the way for a future where robots can handle any chore or task we need. And Pi Zero's capability extends beyond household tasks. It has the potential to transform industrial settings too. In warehouses, for example, it could not only pick and pack items, but adapt to products of different shapes and sizes, or even assist in assembly line tasks that require both precision and agility. There's also significant potential for Pi Zero caregiving, where robots could assist seniors with daily tasks or support people with disabilities by handling physical chores that require adaptable and precise movements. While these advancements are exciting, they also raise important questions. 
One concern is job displacement. If robots become more versatile and begin taking over tasks commonly performed by humans, especially in roles that don't require specialized skills, what does that mean for the workforce? Another issue is privacy and data security. Training robots involves gathering large amounts of data which might include personal spaces or sensitive information, posing potential risks. Additionally, while Pi Zero's technology is cutting edge, making it affordable and accessible to everyday consumers remains a challenge. Currently, the high development and deployment costs of this advanced AI must decrease for widespread adoption to be feasible. Major tech companies and startups are also exploring the potential of general purpose robot. For instance, Elon Musk is working on Tesla's Optimus robot, which he envisions could be available by 2040 at a price point of 20 thousand to twenty five thousand dollars Tesla's Optimus robot is being designed to perform most human tasks promising a future where affordable versatile robots could become commonplace other tech giants including Amazon Google and Nvidia are also investing billions in AI and robotics which means we're likely to see rapid progress over the next few decades so what can Pi zero do right now Physical intelligence shared videos on Pi Zero in action and its capabilities are genuinely impressive. It can pick up and fold clothes, smooth out wrinkles, pack groceries, and even handle delicate items like eggs with precision. What's remarkable is that these aren't just pre-programmed steps. Pi Zero analyzes tasks, makes real-time adjustments, and executes them dynamically. Of course, it's not perfect. Sometimes it overfills an egg carton or accidentally tosses a box of a table. These quirks are part of learning curve as the AI improves. One example of Pi Zero's adaptability is its ability to build a cardboard box. While folding and securing a box might seem straightforward, it's a complex, multi-step task for a robot requiring precise control and careful pressure. Tackling these kinds of challenges shows Pi Zero's capacity to handle sequential, multi-stage tasks that require adaptability and real-time problem solving. In the bigger picture, Pi Zero is still evolving and while it's not yet at the level of language models like ChatGPT, it shares a similar foundational learning principles. It's a significant step toward creating robots with foundational models for physical actions, a robot brain that can grow smarter and more capable over time. By developing Pi Zero as a flexible, generalist AI that can work with different robot types, physical intelligence is pioneering a shift in robotics that could impact various fields. If you're excited about the future of robots in daily life, keep an eye on physical intelligence and the Pi Zero model. They're setting the stage of a new era in robotics where machines are more than task-specific tools. They are adaptable helpers in our world. Let me know your thoughts in the comments and if you enjoyed this breakdown, don't forget to like and subscribe for more updates on the latest AI and tech. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.